All right, I'm going to go ahead and answer this one like this. Listen, our standard of living and our lifestyle and the way that we actually look at things considering the productivity that is now going on in this country, which is literally sick on life support. I don't know what it is. I really, truly don't. And, and, the, and the father knows I speak to us till I'm blue in the face. I don't know what it is that people just do not have the ability to really, truly actually look and see what the reality is. They cannot really, truly bring themselves to look to see what's really, truly going on. And we love living on lies and love living on hope. Listen, listen. You don't wait till things start going awry before you start preparing yourself. You don't wait till the disaster hits and then you go try to run to the store and buy everything up on the shelves because every, that's the attitude of everybody else. That's what everybody else is going to do. <clears throat> if you're wise, you prepare now. You prepare now so that you'll be able to ride the storm out because when everybody else is not prepared, I'm telling you, it, it's ugly. You know, I, I, I know, believe me, I know what we're up against. It's like right now, I'm driving down the road. I'm driving down the road here in, in, in Kentucky. It is nice. It's sunny, not a chemical trail in the sky. Actually, you can really truly see real clouds, real clouds. I mean, really, no chemtrails. Unbelievable, right? I know you don't believe me, right? So let me let you look at it. Look. Real, true clouds. Or are you looking inside the truck? I think you're looking inside the truck. I don't know. But anyway, check it out. <laughs> look at that. That is an unbelievable sign. I don't know if you're looking inside the truck behind me or you're looking inside because I can't tell right now. But real clouds. Unbelievable, isn't it? Isn't it unbelievable? <clears throat> We're going to have to bring ourselves to the literal reality that even though everything looks fine outside right now, it really truly isn't. It really truly isn't. Both, well, let me just say both. I ain't going to say both. I'm going to go all the way around the curve. Socially, politically, economically, religious, every single aspect of it, everything is sick. Everything. The whole house is sick and the whole heart is faint. I just keep on repeating myself like a, like your favorite song. Over and over again. Because I don't want you to get caught up in the whirlwind. I, I really truly don't. Because some of you got children. And I, and I know you care about them. You may care about them children. You may not care about what the things you need to make. And the sacrifice you need to do right now. In order to really truly bring about a care. But I tell you. It's something else. Anyway. Just get a reality and look and really see what's going on and not what somebody hoped for and not what they ran on and, and not what they promised you. 